Hi, this video is brought to you by RachelOBeauty.com. Thank you for watching. If you like what you see, please give me a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe for all the latest on natural hair, fashion, and makeup. Hey everybody, it's Rachel O Beauty and today I'm here to do a very highly requested hairstyle. Um, it's a protective style. It's very easy to do. To do this style, all you're going to need is um, a few bobby pins, the open kind, as well as the closed kind. And then to moisturize, I'm going to be using the Curls Elixir, as well as the Passion Fruit Curl Control Paste. Um, this is a very easy style. And <clears throat> typically what I'll start off doing first is I'll section the hair into, into three parts. This is the bangs part and then the back goes into um, like two separate parts like you're going to do a ponytail. Um, so since I just woke up and this is a, um, a twist out, I'm going to start off with putting the curls oil in. And that's just going to give my hair a little bit of shine, help me to... Um, manage it a little bit better as you guys can see i just recently colored the front part here so this part is extra dry and i love the curls products for that um okay so what we're gonna start out and one thing one other thing i like about this hairstyle is that because this is a fresh twist out um i can wear it in this in a protective style for a few days and then i'll take it down i'll take the twist out down and it will be you'll have like a, a totally new hairstyle Okay, so what I'm going to do first is I'm going to just start off with tuck and rolling. And when I say tuck and roll, that means that you just take the hair and you just literally um, roll it. I like for my rolls to be a little bit full. So I'll pull some of the hair from the back up here. Um, and you just basically start pinning. And it doesn't have to be extremely perfect. But um, you do want your, your, um, your bobby pins to be nice and secure. So you just tuck the bobby pins in like that. And then you go around the back and just do the same. Just roll, roll the hair under like this. And tuck in your tuck in your pins. Now when you okay, so pretty much done with this side. I might go in and make a few adjustments. I'm not into perfect hair, so it doesn't have to be perfect for me. This side, the same thing. Just gonna tuck, just gonna um, roll it. I'm using mainly primarily the um the closed body pins and I use the open ones to just go in and, and um make it even more secure but the closed body pins because you know most time natural hair is really thick and so you need the, the closed body pins for this part so I'm almost done Okay, so when you're done, <clears throat> your hair should look like this. And you could actually wear this top part out like this if you had like twisted it out and, oh, that's not supposed to be there. If you had twisted it out and it was really curly, you could actually wear it out like this. Um, there's two options in regards to the bangs. You can either just roll the bangs under, pin and secure like this but <clears throat> lately what I've been doing is taking them and tucking them this way 
kind of like on a slant because I want it to look a little just a, like a little funky looking um so this is the way that I'm gonna do it but if you guys want to see how it looks the other way you can um follow me on Instagram I have I have a few photos there and this um my Instagram is at Rachel o Beauty. I'm using mainly the open bobby pins here, but I probably will stick some closed ones in here just to be on the safe side. You know, sometimes your hair have a mind, it has a mind of its own. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is just take the passion fruit control paste and I'm gonna use this just to smooth the ed the um the edges. And I love this gel because it's very um it doesn't leave a residue at all. <clears throat> It doesn't make your hair hard, you know. I, I don't typically I don't use a lot of gel, but when I do, I'll use it's the only kind I use. And let's see. That's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoy. Thank you for watching. Bye. Thanks for watching. Don't forget, thumbs up.